Hello everyone. My name is Farhat Ali and in this video we will learn that how we can install IBM SPSS EMS 29 version in our laptop or desktop. If you have not subscribed our channel yet, please subscribe so you can get the daily new videos. So let's start the installation process. At the first step you have to click on the setup process. Setup and here I'm going to click on this setup and uh, I can see that setup launcher has been launched and uh, just click on the option and uh, you will see that the installation process has been started and here I can click on the next option I have to accept the license agreement next here it will ask you to mention the destination folder you can install in your C drive or D drive or E drive it's depend on you I'm going to install in the C folder here I'm going to click on the next button then ready to install the program you have to click on the install button the installation process of IBM SPSS MS 29 has been started it will take few moments around one to two minutes the process will be completed Meanwhile, we have to wait. In the previous video, we have discussed that how we can download the IBM SPSS AMS software you can watch that video uh, and in this video we will see that how we can install the IBM SPS EMS software the installation process is continue and uh, we will see that the option of finish will appear at the end it will take some moments to complete the process Okay, so the installation has been completed and uh, we have to just click on the finish button. After clicking this option, we have to go to the search option and there we have to select the uh, search the authorization wizard. So we can put the authorization key up so we can get the license. Uh, so I'm going to click on the finish button here. It will show me the software. In the next video, we will see that what are the new updates in the SPSS MS29 version. So currently it's uh, telling me that the license validation, no valid license for MS was found. So I'm going to click on the OK button and it will close the application. Now I'm going to click here on the search option and here I can search the license authorization and it will ask me to click on the yes button well when I will click on the yes button it will show me the IBM SPSS authorization wizard and here I can click on the next button here if I have a concurrent user license I if my organization purchase the product and my administrator give me computer name or IP address I will click on this option I'm going to now I'm going to click on the author, authorized user license I purchase a single copy of the product and then I am going to click on the next button. Here will I, I will mention the code that I have received from the IBM SPS EMS software company and uh, I will mention that code here. And uh, after mentioning the code, you will, you know, I'm just putting some numbers here and then you have to click on the add button. And after adding the code, you just have to click on the next button and it will, it will show you that the license time of your software so that's the whole process of uh, ins installing the IBM SPS EMS 29 version in your laptop or desktop in the next video we will see that what are the new updates has been introduced in IBM SPS EMS 29 version 